So, Morgs, it doesn't matter how fit you are this next few weeks, it's hard. How are you finding it so far? Yeah, it's been hard, obviously, but you know, that's what pre season's about. Um, I think the lads have all come back really fit and you know, the sessions have been good. The, the lads look sharp, they've been tough, they've been really tough on the legs, and obviously, but this is what it's all about, and you know, we're enjoying it every step of the way. And feeling part of it, I know when we spoke to you during the summer break, that's important, and coming back and getting into it now, that's brilliant for you. Yeah, I mean, like you said, obviously signing in, in January, but getting injured, you thought as welcome as the lads were, I felt really part of the group. It's, it's hard to feel really part of it when you're not contributing and you can't contribute and you haven't contributed at all yet. So obviously coming into the pre-season and training with the lads and just feeling feeling good, that's really important for me and hopefully I can go forward with that. You played at St George's, you had training towards the end of the season, but how good is it to be doing it now when it, when it really does matter ahead of the new season? Yeah, that's it. Obviously coming towards the end of the season, it was... I was really focusing on just getting myself feeling right and you know in good shape. But I knew I was going to have the summer to really, really hammer that from my point of view and get get fit and really work myself hard, which I've done. And I feel like I've come back in really good shape. And obviously, coming back now and like you said, feeling part of it, it's it's massive for me. Does this come naturally? This running and everything that you're doing, as as well as the ball work, is it something that just comes to you easily? Uh, no, not really. I'm not. I'm not really built for running, really. But you know. <laughs> I'm sure most of the lads will say that, but you know, working hard in the off season, it doesn't matter if you are, or you aren't. You know, if you're fit, you can do it, and that's that's the uh, that's the point of it, really. Getting you fit and making sure you are fit. So, you know, running's hard. No, none of the lads will tell you they enjoy the running, but you know, it's got to be done. It's important, but obviously, the ball work. It's sometimes coming off the off season. It's about knocking the rust off a little bit, but like I said, I think all the lads look really sharp and. Obviously, everyone's really looked, at, looked after themselves in the off-season. It is, isn't it? I mean, it's not just words. It's really competitive out there. There's a, there's a really good environment on the training pitch at the moment. Yeah, it is. I mean, you know, we've got some we've got a really good group now. And, you know, we were saying before, com- competition for places. But everyone's really driving each other on. It's competitive. There's been a few tackles going in. There's been a few people getting on at each other. But that's brilliant. That just shows what kind of group we are. We're, we're all winners. And want to do well and we, we showed that coming back that run the pre-season fixtures isn't too far away what would it be like to, to pull on a Carlisle shirt brilliant you know obviously it'll be a long time coming and you know I'm really looking forward to it to pull on a shirt with my name on the back and obviously going out here hopefully play a homey and hopefully we can have a few fans here and you know start to show the fans what I can do and what the team can do and I'm really looking forward to it and the group is it coming together is it knitting together already yeah I think it happens naturally I don't think I think new signings come in have really settled and you know the group's a really tight-knit group anyway it just shows how good we are as a team at, at that and how how well we're, we're going to be going forward and for yourself Morg I think you've said it to us in a couple of interviews you don't really have anything to prove but it's just a case of showing what you're about yeah that's it obviously you know I believe in myself and my abilities but it's just about showing it to you know the staff have shown really a lot of faith in me which I'm really appreciate, uh, appreciated so Obviously, it's about repaying them and obviously showing the fans what I can do and showing myself getting back to where I was at previous before the injuries. And just finally, Morgs, I've got to develop the blue and red theme. If Corey Whelan's getting the ball to his chest and you're steaming in, are you going through him for the blue side of the city? Well, not just that. I think anyone in the session, you know, if the ball's there to win, you go and win it. But now, obviously, you know, we've had a bit of banter over the last few days. Obviously, I went and poor, but I was quick to remind him of the 2 0 win at Anfield last time out but now Corey's a brilliant lad and obviously you know we're on the same team now so you know we've, we're getting on really well and you know I think we'll develop a good partnership if we play together in the season Marcus, thanks for your time on